If you believe in God, you believe that God made everything from the tiniest, tiniest microbe to everything. So if you're God that you love so much, created COVID-19, no, I hope you're pleased man, with man. yourself. God bless you, man. You know, Jesus Christ can deliver you from darkness. Jesus Christ delivered me. I was an atheist. I did not believe in God. I was a drug addict. I was out doing crime on yeah, the street. Yeah, we in Bazadon today preaching the gospel of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. The Lord be to God. I was walking around this place in Bazadon doing drugs, doing crime, causing trouble. I was in complete darkness. That's I was right. out partying and raving. But Jesus Christ, Hello. he saved me. <laughs> I was in my bedroom one night about to commit suicide. And I heard a voice in my heart. And this voice told me to pray. And I heard one voice that told me to pray. And I prayed. And Jesus Christ come into my bedroom wearing a white robe and he visited me in my bedroom and Jesus Christ touched my life and transformed my life. He set me free from drugs. He set me free from depression. He set me free from mental health. Jesus Christ has given me a brand new life, born again, a new heart, new desires. And everybody that comes to Jesus Christ, everybody that calls upon him, that desires to turn from their sins can have a new life in Christ. Jesus says you must be born again That's if right. you are to enter the kingdom of heaven. You have to be born again because if you die without Jesus Christ, you are going to perish in hell. People that are a place called hell, a place of torment for the people that reject Jesus Christ. The Bible says if that we do not believe in the Son of God, we are condemned already. Jesus Christ is the Saviour. We must believe in Him. If we are not to believe in Him, the Bible says we are condemned because we do not believe in the only begotten name of the Son of God, the Holy Spirit is here to change us and when we call upon jesus christ we shall be saved people turn from your sins turn from your wickedness this world is lying in darkness the reason for the reason for the sicknesses the reason for the viruses the reason for death the reason for people doing the things that they do is because of sin sin is a disease sin affects the whole human race people sin it's a disease that affects your soul, your heart, your mind. It comes through Adam and Eve. Because Adam sinned, you're all born into sin, people. You see a baby in a cot, it looks innocent. But when that baby grows up, you don't have to teach it to be rebellious. You don't have to teach it to be selfish. The, the roots of sin is in the heart of the child. So people, we are born into sin. We have to give our lives to Jesus Christ. We have to call upon him because he is the one that can save us from sins. No one else can save but through Jesus Christ. No other name given under heaven by what, by what we must be saved but through Jesus Christ. People turn from your sins. Give your heart to Jesus. He is coming back again yes. to rapture his people. Jesus is coming back very soon. That's right. Jesus is going to rapture his people. Hallelujah. Love him above all things. You must love God with all your heart, with all your soul, all your mind, and all your strength. People, God's commandments are there to show us that we have sinned against God. Do not lie, God says, and we have all lied against the living God. We have all used God's name in vain in one way or another. We have not honoured the name of God. We have put his name for the dirt. We have, we have caused God's name to be blasphemed. We have blasphemed his name by the way we live. People, we must repent. We must give our life to Jesus Christ because there is coming a day of judgment. Everyone is going to die one day, but after death is the judgment of God for every single person. People, turn from your sins. Turn from your wicked ways. Let the, unri let the unrighteous man forsake his ways and the un unrighteous man let him forsake his evil faults because Jesus Christ is coming. Jesus Christ is going to judge this world in righteousness. He is going to judge sin. People, time is running out. Jesus died on the cross for your sins. Jesus, Jesus suffered and he suffered for your sins, people. You nailed him to the cross with your sins. I nailed him to the cross with my sins. But I have repented. I have trusted in the Lord and he has made me new. He has changed me. He has given me a new life. He has given me a reason to live upon this earth. I was in depression. I was in darkness. I heard voices in my mind. I, was, I had schizophrenia. The doctors labelled me as a schizophrenia. Schizophrenic. I locked myself away, paranoid. I was on crack and cocaine. I was sniffing. I was smoking cannabis. I was doing a lot of things. People in darkness. 
but God saved me. God delivered me. Jesus set me free. Woo. Jesus gave me a new life. And Hallelujah. He gave you a new life. Yes. He can set you free from your sicknesses. That's he right. He can heal you. He can set you free from your darkness. He can set you free from your sin. If you call upon him, if you desire to turn from your sins, Jesus Christ will help you. People, when you call upon Jesus, he sends the Holy Spirit. And the Holy Spirit will begin to change you That's and transform right. you and make you born again. Because if you're not born again, you cannot enter heaven. Heaven and hell is real. People, this life is temporary. Mm. This world is temporary. Tell it. Your sins are only going to pleasure you for a while. Mm. But then the wages of sin is death. Mm. After death is a judgment of God. You have oh, to my give my an my account my. of everything you have done. Said, full, filled, everything. Your life is going... Your life is recorded in the book of God. People, God's willing to forgive your sins. He's willing to blot your life, your name out of the book mm. of death and put your name in the book of life. But you must call upon Jesus Christ. You must say, Jesus, forgive me of my sins. I am a sinner. I have done wrong in your eyes. I have lied. I have stolen. I have used your name in vain. I have committed adultery. Jesus says, if you look at a woman or a man to lust after them in your heart, you have committed adultery in your heart. People will we have all lusted. We have all lied. And Jesus says, if we lie, we are going to have our part in the lake which burns with fire. But Jesus is willing to forgive you if you call upon him. People, time is running out. This world is going to perish. And everything in this world is going to perish. Stop seeking these temporal things. Stop seeking the pleasures of this world. Turn from your sins. Turn from this world. Jesus is coming back. Jesus is going to rapture the church people. Jesus is coming to rapture the people that love him. The people that have turned from their sins and living holy. Jesus is coming. Jesus loves you. And he died on a sin. God Who bless you. On the cross for your sins. People, Jesus Christ God bless you. is going to come. Do you want Very any prayers? soon. Time is no, running right. out. God bless you. you. People, call upon Jesus Christ while he's still there. Call upon the Lord while he is still there. Where he can still hear you. People, your sins have separated you from the living God. You was born into sin. Adam and Eve was born perfect perfect in the eyes of god we was all made in the image and likeness of god but sin separated us from god mm. sin we have inherited corruption mm. we were born into co corruption and sin because what adam and eve done people turn from your sins turn from your wicked ways stop lying stop drug using stop stealing people come to god now for salvation Tomorrow is not promised to anybody. Jesus means. Christ is the Savior. Yes. You could be walking along, you could go to sleep tonight and you could yes. not wake up. Mm. People, tomorrow is not promised to anybody. Mm. This COVID, this what's going around the world, these plagues is because of sin, pestilence. Jesus prophesied of what's going to happen. It's all in the Bible. And soon there is going to be a mark of the beast. People, this what? vaccine. Jesus loves you so much. What? My dad yeah. was hit by a car. After that, what happened? Well, what Jesus happened was so dad went into he hospital and, and, um, and he, he uh, shot us a black heart and got us on the head. So I'm very upset Jesus and I need prayer. Right now? Yes, I'm Elizabeth. Close your eyes. Father, we just pray right now for Elizabeth, Lord. We pray, Lord, um, that you bring peace to her life and comfort, oh God, as she's mourning for her dad, God. Father, I pray, Lord, that you bring healing to her soul in the name of Jesus. Father, I pray for peace in the household. In Jesus' name we pray. Thanksgiving. Amen. He didn't die. He didn't die. No, what it was was he was crossing the road near um near um where I live in in Whitmore Way, okay. and he came he went to take some tablets back, yeah. and a car clipped him, mm. and I know I know it sounds silly that I I, I just feel that and they charged the man but it's not enough. Because yeah. dad, Dad's got pain everywhere now. Was well, your dad alive? Yes. He's in hospital? No, he was in hospital. He's home now. Oh, okay. He's, I, so he's recovering? Yeah, but okay. it's just that it's just that people, oh, everybody, not, every, I know, what church are you from? I'm, I'm not from here. Oh, yeah, I'm not from here. So, what was, um, so where well, your dad is home now? Yes. Yes, yeah, home now. Just okay. pray for his speedy recovery. Yeah, yeah, okay. You, you can, you can, 
you can always get in contact with us yeah yeah yeah, yeah. god bless you yeah yeah God bless Jesus you. Is Hallelujah. Coming. Jesus, come on, Hallelujah. everybody, Thank everybody, you, Jesus. everywhere to repent. Repent from your sins. Repent from your wickedness. Jesus Christ is coming. Jesus Christ is going to church. The world in righteousness, people, time is running out. You have not got time. Tomorrow is not promised. You could be walking along and something could happen. You could have an accident. You cannot wake up and you will slip off to eternity. Your souls are eternal. Your bodies are temporal. People, your bodies are going into the ground, but your souls, they shall live forever. This world is temporary. All the pleasures of this world is temporary. Stop 